Hey there friends, in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to make a basic pie chart graph. Super easy process in numbers, let's do it right now. Okay, so we're working on our Mac today within numbers. This is Apple's version of Excel, and we wanna make a basic pie chart. So we're gonna be doing this using this super simple spreadsheet. Again, we're gonna have this represent uh, potential total sales in these specific months. Now to make a chart or a graph, what we're gonna do is we're gonna actually select the area that we want uh, to be shown up visually. So I want obviously all of this information, I'm gonna start on the January cell, I'm gonna click and actually hold and go all the way down to the bottom number down here and then release. So once we have all these cells selected, we can then actually come up here to our chart button. I'm gonna click on this and you can see we have all sorts of charting options that allow us to create a really nice visual. So for the pie chart options, we can come down here, you can see you can have this donut shape where there's a hole in the middle, your traditional pie chart, and there's obviously different color schemes too that you can choose from by using these arrows. Let's go ahead and start with this simple one right here. I'm gonna click on that. And once you click on it, it's automatically going to chart for you. Again, this is gonna be located directly below your spreadsheet, usually in the white background area, so you can see it a little bit better. And what we can actually do is grab it, and we can bring it, drag it up anywhere we want. In this case, I'm gonna just bring it up below our numbers. And as you can see, we now have correlating data in this nice pie chart format. We also have our key up here that shows us exactly what these numbers represent. This is obviously in a percentage format. So if we'd like to change that, you can actually come over here, just make sure you're on the wedges section. And there's all sorts of formats that we can use down here. You can see this is in percentage. And let's say I wanted to see the exact number, or maybe I wanted to see it in currency. I can click on that and it'll automatically adjust so it matches. Again, this is a great way to give visualization to your data, especially if you're giving presentations. Friends, that was a very, very basic overview of how to create a pie chart within numbers. If that helped, hit that thumbs up button. If you have any more specific questions, maybe with something you wanna be a little more creative on, go ahead and, and hit us up in the comments section with those questions, we do our best to answer. And you also might want to subscribe because we got a bunch more tutorial videos with the numbers that is coming up really, really soon. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you again in the next video.